<sighs> I haven't. I would have gone insane a long time ago. Oh wait. It's too late for that. Damn it. My logic has just been irrefuted with evidence. <laughs> Shit. I was about to say, I wonder how many people I offended with that one. <laughs> Why? Because I'm going to offend people with it? <laughs> I, I know, I know. I try to, truth be told, I mean... That spawned a massive argument in my car with my parents the other day. <laughs> what? All oh, about religion. Someone had one of those little fish on their car, the Christian fish, and I just started making fun the Jeebus fish. I just started making fun of the car, and my parents started yelling at me for making fun of someone's religion. <laughs> what? Yeah, but I try not to do it in front of them because it pisses them off. But I don't really care. I mean, I don't care. I mean, there's no other way to say it. Congrats! You're gonna be an acapella person now. Good. I know. I remember. I have to drive with you when you're playing stuff on the radio. Well, I don't try to sing. Because I understand that I'm tone deaf. It's not like I know I'm offensive, but I just don't care. Alright. Now on to fight the giant guy who has Tommy guns in a kid's game. That. Whatever. So the main boss for the first world is like a master mind who wants to destroy ships and planes with storms. Second guy's a gangster who uses lots of guns. Third one's a voodoo witch who like practices human sacrifice. Fourth one causes avalanches that buries villages and the fifth one's like like a satanist. That is a weird ass show. I watched that on Netflix. Well, I know we were Netflix. Which one? Oh, I don't really go through by seasons, no, but. Wait till you see Strigoi. Strigoi is weird. Strigoi made me mad. Not for a while. You seen Mongolian Deathcrawler? The giant centipede. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> look, at, look at those spikes on the fire. Shut up. Yeah, that happens. Sly Cooper, the only raccoon that can get shot by a hunter and not die. Yeah, but we weren't very bright back then, Kennedy. Remember this. Well, we're better. Kind of. Sometimes. Buddy. So are you watching season two? Have you seen Vampire yet? Oh, that one was weird. Yeah. The Vampire one, I was surprised they aired because it just like, it's like it was just awful, and it's like on Animal Planet. I mean, kids watch Animal Planet. I. It's like. There were a, ma a rash of disappearances where the victims were drained of blood. It's like, oh. Yeah, that too. I got freaked out by Beast of Bray Road. That kind of freaked me out. Oh. Uh, what? 
the Josie Dragon, Josie Devil kind of just... It, it just, it kind of freaked me out just with the whole, like, it fucking breaks down the door and comes in after the 10 year old. It's like, oh. <laughs> oh. Give. Let's see how badly I die on my first time. Oh, whatever. What? Oh, I'm glad you didn't look. I'm gonna watch that on the recording. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Yeah, uh, yeah. I actually got shot in the cutscene. Yeah. Uh, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna be mad at me. I'm sorry. Please don't hit me. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Come get me, bitch. Did you see Wendigo yet? Oh, Wendigo is awesome. Freaky, but awesome. I have not seen that yet. I need to go see that still. Okay. You gonna get me in for free? Oh, it's not? Is that grains? Mic on? Really? Interesting. Kennedy. He's like I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Which movie? Oh yeah, Finding Dory. Oh yeah, the caves. All I can think of is the one time it's like. Someone posed online, a man who watches his wife and children butchered, like now stuck with a disabled son who gets lost, he has to like travel with a mentally handicapped woman to find him from his kidnappers. You little bitch. Hey, I hit circle, you little fucking order. Shooter! There we go. Has to go find his kid. Oh yeah, his name is Marlon and his son's name is Nemo. It's like, oh, mind fuck. Is that like the, uh, um, one? Oh yeah, it's like, uh, I hang out with a stuck up bitch who doesn't know anything. I hang out with a dyke who's so dyke she practice, practically starts purring whenever we go past the hardware store. And a stoner and his do who's so high he thinks his dog talks and he always eats all my food. Plus we go around in my van and solve mysteries all the time. Gagged. <laughs> you should be. I am your sandwich. Oh. Shot section of the previous raccoons contain an entry from my Tasmanian ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper. His specialty was the rail walk. A lifetime effect in the old west. Getting out of town proved to be a little more challenging than getting in. Having just missed us, Inspector Fox went for the next best thing and dragged that canine steroid case off to jail. That was the end of Mugshot's gambling empire, and Mesa City's citizens soon returned home. While me and the boys, well, we enjoyed the rest of our stay in America, and then returned to Paris, ready for our next mission.